Hi, John Malenczak at NoteFlight, and in this quick video, we're going to show you how to customize instruments in NoteFlight Premium. So I have a brass fugue here, but let's say uh, instead of a French horn player, I may have a euphonium or baritone player that wants to play this line. So to add or customize instruments, you can go to the Instruments panel, and you see a list of all of your instruments here. You can rearrange the order of your instruments simply by dragging and dropping lines, and you notice it rearranges on the score, which is an exciting feature. Uh, you can add new instruments by simply adding an instrument and searching for or selecting an instrument from the dropdown, and then you have additional names, or you can edit existing instruments by using the pin or edit icon, and it opens up the instrument dialog. So in this case, French horn is selected, but let's say I want to play this on euphonium. Now, we might not have euphonium as a prenamed instrument, but we could use another sound to create this. So example, I could select trombone, but I could change the name to euphonium. And then the short name would be youth. And since I selected trombone, the key and um, clef will be co correct, so we can just simply hit OK and notice the parts change to euphonium and the instrument has been transposed accordingly. Now I could do the same thing for my trumpets. In fact, these parts might lay a lot better on E-flat trumpet. So maybe I want to use the same instrument, but in this case, I want it to be a trumpet and E-flat part. So I'll change the name and I'll simply change the key of the instrument here and we should have a trumpet and E-flat part. Now in this case, trumpet and E-flat, as we know, transposes up, so we'll simply transpose the octave now to adjust for that, and now we've made the first trumpet part an E-flat part. So that is how you use customized instruments in NoteFlight Premium.